Hey everybody, Jason Shadrick here at the 2016 NAMM show in Anaheim, and that was Eddie. And we're here at the Mojo Tone booth to talk about some new pickups they have, and also their new, uh, couple of new amps they brought to the show. So first we're going to talk to David here from Mojo Tone. And David, uh, first thing we're going to look at now are the pickups yeah. in this Strat that Eddie was playing. So tell us a little bit about uh, these new uh, pickups for you guys. So these are the new Mojo Tone Quiet Coil pickups, they're home canceling pickups. And those are the 58 quiet coils. We also offer a 67 quiet coil, mm -hmm. and they're based after those years. Yep. And uh, so those are like a 1958 spec, um, and they're they're really a passive design. They sound just like single coils. They have the chime, the clarity, yeah. articulation, and everything. But no hum. No hum, yeah. which is the beauty of them. Um, so if you listen to like if he does some clean stuff, it's just the clarity's there, the quack, everything, just like a like a vintage Strat pickup. So you don't have that, you don't lose your tone on like a stacked pickup, you know. It doesn't compress the top end. It's really smooth and clear, which is really unique to this design. We basically try to make them as close to a single coil as possible, so the height of the coil is exactly the same as a single coil, the length of the coil is exactly the same. It's basically split in half, and they're wound directly around Alnico magnets, mm -hmm. just like a single coil would be. Um, so you get that, that Alnico tone, the, the clarity, the feel, and everything of a single coil. And they're easy to pop in any strat style that has those kind of same sizes yes, for regular yeah, single no, coils? No modifications for these. I mean, they're very very much like a Strat pickup yeah. in every way. They have the, the four bond material like a vintage Strat pickup. They use cloth covered leads like a vintage Strat pickup. And then we also use the, you know, like a 42 gauge wire, right. like the form bar or the plain enamel. So, and they, they match everything. If you were to spec it, it matches the DCR, the inductance, the capacitance, the resonant peak frequency, everything matches a single coil. Mm -hmm. So. And what's going to be kind of the rough price range and availability on these pickups? Um, so individually, they're going to go for $79.95 a piece, yep. and they're available in black, white, aged white, and the 67 model and the 58 model. The sets, I think, are $229.95, okay. and then we're also doing a pre-wired pick guard assembly, yep. and it's completely solderless, oh. and you can choose your pick guard, all kinds of things, and those are going to be $299.95. Oh, nice. So it's just a pop in and go. You don't have to have any solder skills and ready to roll so right. let's hear eddie play a little bit more of these pickups yeah. one thing i want to show is uh on this amp i'm going to have it on the overdrive channel and i'm going to crank the gain and the volume a little bit and the volume on my guitar is all the way up and i'm not hearing anything <laughs> that's awesome <laughs> Next we have Andrew here from Mojo Tone, and we had David talk about the pickups that Eddie was playing here. Now we're going to talk about your guys' new amp line here, and the one we just heard from Eddie was the uh, the Deacon. So tell us first a little bit about the Deacon, and then we can look at the other ones in the line. Right on. So the Deacon is our 50 watt. It's uh, two KT66 power tubes, has two channels, a foot switch uh, effects loop, so you can preset your pedals and just turn them all on at the you know the touch of a foot switch right um, the uh, the the FX uh, loop return is also a volume boost mm -hmm. if you need it to be uh, all the amps are hand wired in Burgall North Carolina Mojo has been uh, building guitar amplifiers for over two decades yeah. so we have plenty of experience uh, you're looking at uh, our pilot combo uh, right there um, 
showing off the the, the clean cleanliness of the you know the way we wire everything yeah. things point to point So the other one we have over here is the is the pilot, the MT pilot. Tell us a little bit about that one. So the pilot's a 20 watt, uh, two 6V6 tubes. Uh, you can uh, install 6L6 tubes to get up to about 30 watts of power. Yep. It's got a three position uh, bright switch, interactive uh, three band EQ, a depth control, power amp. Uh, it's sort of like a throttle control. It also has a switchable FX loop. Biggest of the three over here is the Hatteras. Tell us about this uh, 100 watt half stack here. Yeah, also another hand wired amp, uh, 100 watts, 4 KT66 tubes. Uh, it also has you know three position bright switch. We basically took the clean section of the pilot and the distortion uh, channel of the Deacon and put those into a 100 watt platform. Yeah. Uh, super great amp, and it, it, we call it the workhorse. It does everything from country to metal. And uh, yeah, and everything in between. It's really bad amp. So Andrew, tell us a little bit about the pricing and availability for these three uh, these three new models. Yes. Uh, so the availability probably early March through our dealer network. The pilot head's going to map at sixteen ninety five. Deacon head's going to map at twenty one fifty, and the Hatter's head's going to map at twenty six ninety five. And where can people go online to find out more information about the amps, the pickups, and everything else that you guys do? You can go to mojotone.com or mojotoneamps.com. Andrew, thank you so much. Yes, sir. Thank you, guys. This is Jason Shadrick with PremierGuitar.com. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel to watch tons of coverage from this year's NAMM show.